What's up guys, Tristan Niagara here with another video. Today we're doing another review. We're doing a review on Gorilla Mode Stem. Whoa, look at that. The sickest label. I wish it was in like a bigger bottle because you can just see. Let's bring this in a little bit closer so you guys can see. Like, look at that. So this is Gorilla Mind's new energy formula. So it says pre-workout formula on here, but they've branded it as an energy drink, sort of energy formula. I'm really excited about this because right now they are currently out of Gorilla Mind Rush. So I have been in need of something like this that is packed full with efficacious dosages of high quality ingredients like they always do. They never fail to put out an incredible product. So I'm really stoked on this one. We're gonna mix it right here in front of you guys because I need a little bit of a boost. So if I get hyper during this video, don't mind me. I'm just uh, going gorilla mode on you. You know, that's just how the, the jungle rolls, you know? You gotta go gorilla sometimes. And I don't mind because I got like gorilla mode nitric for later. There's a little stimulant free pre-workout. If you haven't seen that review, go check it out in some of my earlier videos. So we're gonna do two scoops because I'm an absolute caffeine fiend. If you hadn't watched some of my vlogs during my bodybuilding prep, uh, that was, unfortunately the show was canceled. I wasn't able to compete in my final form. You'll know in those vlogs that I drink a lot of caffeine. I was, um, it, it's not healthy at all. It's not advisable. Do not do that at home. Do not follow what I do because I am a fiend. I'm a gorilla, you know? I can handle that kind of amount, that amount of caffeine in my body. So I was having like nine, I think I counted up to like a few, like a thousand, 200 milligrams of caffeine. It was just absolutely insane. I would have like six monsters and then I would have gorilla mode pre-workout and then I would have uh, maybe some grill mine rush or something. I don't advise this, uh, advise this at all. Uh, do not do that. You should not even be exceeding like the max dose of like gorilla mode or gorilla mode mine rush. If you have six capsules of Gorilla Mind Rush, you shouldn't have any more caffeine for the day. That's good enough for you, okay? So, taste test. Oh, so tropical. They have it in uh, mango peach. You can kind of see it on here. Kind of hard to see it. It's a small little tub. They don't put any filler ingredients into this product. So let's, let's get into the ingredients. It tastes, it tastes so good, guys. I put two scoops in for about 10 to 14 ounces of water. I think that's 10 to 14 ounces. I don't really know. As long as you have enough water in there, it's gonna taste really, really good. And I see guys like dry scooping this, which is absolutely insane. Cause this stuff tastes so good. I don't know why you wouldn't want to sip on something like this. Like I see people dry scooping all the time. I don't know if they just like hate tasting something good in their mouth for like a longer period of time. It doesn't make sense. It's like getting a bag of candy at the grocery store, blending it up in a blender and then like shotgunning it all. You would think the person is absolutely insane. So I think people that like get a good tasting pre-workout and they just hock it down, like it's all about the ingredients and what it does to your body during the workout. If something tastes good, why don't you just sip it for like a little bit longer so you enjoy the taste before your workout. Like having my pre-workout before uh, exercising is almost like a treat in itself. I get to have my pre-workout before my workout. I'm sipping on it on the drive, drive over. I'm listening to my EDM and hard style like Ziz playlist and go, getting absolutely fucking amped before my workouts. That's like the good feeling, you know? That's like part of like the gym ritual is, he, is, is the drive over, listening to your beats, going to meet up with your buddies. You're gonna go do an absolutely insane freaking lift and get absolutely amped, go gorilla mode. We made it, boys.
I'm getting off topic here, guys. Anyways, let's get into the ingredients. I have all the ingredients on my computer right here. So if I look over, I'm looking at the ingredients because I don't have them absolutely memorized. Sorry, I didn't spend 20 minutes trying to like memorize every single ingredient and how much dosage is for one scoop and two scoops, all right? So first ingredient is L-tyrosine. It's a nootropic ingredient that helps with cognitive abilities. It improves your alertness, focus and energy. Great for like mind muscle connection and cutting your rest times. Keep in mind again, this is an energy formula. I use this during the day for like a little like boost. It'll improve my mood. It improves my focus, my concentration, and my cognitive abilities to allow me to work longer, more efficiently, and be more energized doing it and have a better mood while I'm doing it. Cause it sucks being in a bad mood and uh, trying to like grind out hours of work. Uh, so this helps me every once in a while when I'm on those low days, where I don't have as much energy, or maybe I ate too many carbs and I'm like, I need to like lie down. I'll take some Gorilla Mode Stim for a little like midday little boost, okay? Don't take this after, like, I wanna say like 6 p.m. If you're, if you're super sensitive to caffeine, don't take this uh, after like maybe noon or like one or 2 p.m. You're gonna be up all night because this is very high in caffeine and stimulants. So the L-tyrosine is 3,000 milligrams. What you saw on the uh, Gorilla Mode right here is only a 1,500 milligrams of L-tyrosine. So you'll notice a lot of these ingredients are uh, the exact same in Gorilla Mode. They basically took out the pump ingredients because it's not supposed to be meant for solely just the gym. It's meant for uh, doing work at home, if you're studying, things like that. It's a great, uh, you know, double, uh, product you know it's great as an energy drink but it's also great for in the gym as well okay so they also have kana in there all the all these ingre ingredients are the same in gorilla mode every ingredient you'll see in gorilla mode stim is also in the gorilla mode original pre-workout but some of the ingredients are higher so like for example the l tyrosine it's double kana as well is double the amount. So in Gorilla Mode, it has 500 milligrams. In Gorilla Mode Stim, there's a thousand milligrams. So Kana is an actually an interesting uh, ingredient to put into these pre-workouts. It's definitely a newer ingredient that companies have been putting into their products. And I love Kana. I've taken Kana by itself. And it's kind of like this grassy sort of like planty herb. And they, I guess they grind it up and they put it into the pre-workout. Kana is an overall mood enhancer. That's the main reason why it would be in here. It can also reduce appetite, lower anxiety levels. Um, asterisk beside that because there's no proven studies of that. That's just what it's been shown anecdotally. So next, and they bumped that up to 1000. Uh, so double the dose of your mood elevation, your mood increaser. So. I really like Kana. I'm really happy that people have been, uh, companies have been putting that into their uh, products. Uh, next on the list is caffeine and hydras. So most of you are going to know what caffeine is and it increases your energy levels. It improves in performance, it makes you less tired. Everyone always looks at the caffeine dose and that's probably the only ingredient that people understand or really recognize on a label. So it's important to understand all of these ingredients and what they do and why people, why companies are putting them in there, whether it's just a filler product, a filler ingredient where they're just trying to make it look like they have more on their label for cheaper. They'll do this with like antioxidants. A lot of the time they bumped this up to 375 milligrams. There's only, there's 350 milligrams in the original Gorilla Mode, 375 in this. So you're getting a 25 uh, milligram increase, which is great. I really like having a high uh, caffeine dose for the day because I'm tolerant to caffeine. Most of you are, you probably have coffee all a lot of the time, energy drinks, pre-workouts. So having a higher caffeine dosage is always uh, recommended in my books anyways. So 
definitely like that. Next on the list is N-phenethyl dimethylamine citrate. They upped this from 350 milligrams to 375 milligrams. This is also known as the love drug or PEA. No, it will not make you like Johnny Sins in the bedroom, but it will increase the release of serotonin, uh, adrenaline, dopamine, no repinephrine, and it's gonna make you feel good. That's why it's the love drug, because it makes you feel good. It makes you all lovey-dovey, you know? That's the main reason why they put that in there, and it's great for cognitive enhancement. It's going to make you smarter. It's gonna make you feel good, and that's gonna help you either in the gym or at home when you're just doing your work or you're studying. That was loud. Keep it down out there. Hold down. Okay, next next on the uh, list of ingredients is bioparian. Pretty standard, it's the same same dosage as Gorilla Mode. It's gonna help with uh, the absorption and prolonging the effects of all the other ingredients in the product. Lastly, we have Huprazine A at 400 micrograms, which is the same as Gorilla Mode. Causes an increase in the levels of acetylcholine. Acetylcholine is one of the chemicals that our nerves use to communicate in the brain, muscles, and other areas. It has been shown to improve energy levels, alertness, and focus. So that's all the ingredients. Great, great product. I've already taken it several times, and it's a great little uh, energy drink replacement. It's going to be cheaper than most energy drinks per serving, I guess. And I believe it's only... Let me look. Let me look, guys. Let's go to Grill of Mind's site. I think with the Labor Day sale, the Labor Day sale might be gone, so it's gonna be approximately $32.99 uh, per serving. So there's 40 servings in this if you're only using one scoop. So that's like less than a dollar per serving. If you're using it uh, two scoops, you're only gonna get 20 servings, which is still quite a bit for $32.99. Approximately like $2, maybe less for uh, your energy drink for the day keep you focused, alert, increase your uh, mood, elevate your mood. And if you compare this to a lot of different uh, ingredients in, uh, or if you, if you compare this to other like energy drinks, the energy drinks don't even compare. So if you look at something like Monster, which I'm looking at right now, and I'm not shitting on Monster, I drink Monster all the time. I really like their products, they taste amazing. And you know what? It's just what it is for. Like it just has, it's a big caffeine boost. That's all, that's all it is. Okay. So don't, don't look at the ingredients and look at all these like antioxidants, which are known to decrease performance levels. They don't really do anything. You can get all your antioxidants from vegetables, fruits, food, like you're going to get that from everything. And my mic just cut out. For fuck's sakes. When you're comparing this to something like an energy drink, this is much more, Gorilla Mode Stim is much more complex and more well put together than any energy drink that you'll see on the market. Most of these energy drinks are simply just caffeine. That's the only thing you're getting uh, dosed correctly on. And if you are getting dosed correctly on, it's gonna be like 100 to 200 milligrams per your dose. If you're taking the full dose of Gorilla Mode Stim, you're getting 375 milligrams of caffeine for it. An absolutely effective dose of caffeine that's gonna keep you energized for most of the day. Another thing that you're gonna see that them put, they put into energy drinks as like a filler to make it seem like they have more ingredients than they do, uh, is they're gonna add a lot of antioxidants, things like vitamin C, um, vitamin B6, vitamin B12, which has all been shown to negatively affect your performance. They don't do anything for your cognitive abilities, so don't get it confused. None of these ingredients are actually going to help you, and if anything, they're gonna hinder your your, uh, your cognitive abilities and your performance in the gym. So, another thing I also see a lot of like brands do in their like energy formulas or like gaming formulas, is they'll add things like pump ingredients for like endurance. They'll be very low dosed, 
So if you're going to compare it to anything, compare it to Gorilla Mode's pump ingredients and how much they dose their products, these uh, gaming formulas and all these like energy formulas don't even compare. They don't have nearly in close uh, to the efficacious dosage. If you don't know what efficacious means, it means like the maximum effective dosage. So it means like the maximum uh, amount of ingredients that you requires to uh, fully take advantage of the properties and the benefits of that ingredient, if that makes sense. Um, so I also don't know why they would put an endurance ingredient into something like a gaming formula. You're not using like a ton of muscles when you're playing video games. If anything, you just want more of the ingredients that keep you awake, alert, improve your cognitive abilities to be able to, you know, gain better, be more alert, be more focused, be smarter, make decisions faster. Those are things that you want. You don't want something that's just gonna make your muscles like work longer. Like you're not like flailing your arms around, you're just clicking your fingers. Like I play StarCraft and all these other video games sometimes it doesn't take a lot of muscle energy to be able to perform in these games. I don't know why they're putting those ingredients in there. That's why things uh, like a product like this, Gorilla Mode Stim, just has the focus, energy, and cognitive enhancing ingredients. The last thing I will touch on is comparing this, uh, or no, combining this with Gorilla Mode Nitric. This is an absolute killer combo. So currently, Gorilla Mo Nitric, unfortunately, is out of stock. I heard it's going to be restocked uh, within uh, a few weeks, two weeks, I'm not sure exactly the, the date on that. But the reason why this is such a great combo is because these both these products don't share any ingredients. None of the ingredients are the, are, are the same. Not one. Whereas, the Gorilla Mode and Gorilla Mode Stim, you won't ever want to combine because they have almost all the same ingredients, excluding the pump products from the Stim, or uh, from the original Gorilla Mode. The reason why this combo, Nitric and Stim, are so great is because, and it's better than the Gorilla Mode original with the Gorilla Mode Nitric, it was because Gorilla Mode and Gorilla Mode Nitric share some of the same pumping ingredients. This is still an amazing, amazing combination, but if you're looking for the max dose for the pump and the energy and the focus, you're gonna wanna combine Gorilla Mode Nitric and Gorilla Mode Stim because you're getting the max dosages for of caffeine, L-tyrosine, Kana, all of those ingredients, while you're also getting all of the NO enhancing, the NO standing for nitric oxide enhancing uh, pump ingredients. Things like a max dose of L-citrulline at 10,000 milligrams, creatine 5,000 milligrams, betaine anhydrase 4,000, glycer pump 4,000. Like I could just go on and on with the amount of ingredients that they have in this product. So. I've taken both of these together and it is the best combo I have ever taken. This beats, the these two together beats any other pre-workout I've ever taken in my life. So if that doesn't sell you on the product, I don't know what will. Compare any of these products, uh, their labels, to any of the pre-workouts you have ever taken. I guarantee, I guarantee you will not find anything higher dosed. Um, and the kicker is these products aren't like insanely expensive. They should be selling these for things for like $80 a bottle, but yet you can buy nitric for $49.99. You can buy Gorilla Mode Stim for $32.99. And lastly, you can buy Gorilla Mode, which all obviously isn't in stock right now as well. You can only buy the Gorilla Mode Stim, the EAAs. Um, right now, but they will be getting back into stock. It just shows you how great these products are because they sell out really, really fast. So make sure you sign up to their newsletter so that you can be notified immediately when they're back in stock. But yeah, Grill Mode, $44.99. You're not gonna find products with this high of uh, dosages for this low of price. That tastes absolutely amazing. Like. They taste awesome, all right?
So, and lastly, 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 I now have a code. You can use Tristan to support me. You'll get 10% off your entire order. So use that code, Tristan, lowercase, uppercase, doesn't matter. At your checkout, you'll get 10% off. And that helps me out make better content for you guys. So if you like this video, please consider subscribing. Throw me a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And all right guys, battery got too hot, so my camera turned off and absolutely screwed me. So I have to make this super quick. Like the video, subscribe, follow me uh, on everything, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, all that good stuff. I'm gonna be posting a lot, a lot more. And yeah, use my code Tristan, 10% off. That helps me out so I can buy a new camera that doesn't shut off after 20 minutes of recording, okay? Talk to you guys soon. Love you guys. Peace. Yeah.